Hello queens, today I am bringing y'all my first look of this year and I'm jumping off this year by doing my hair, okay? Today we're doing a wig installation. This unit was sent to me by Asha Mary Hair. They sent me a 26 inch highlighted wig and y'all already know I love to do the customization and all that off camera. So we're just gonna step right into the installation process. And I'm starting this video off by cutting my ear tabs. I don't know about y'all, but I like to cut off the excess lace before I go in and install the wig. It just makes it easier for me to apply. I don't know why, it just does. Now I'm going in with my Even Lace Bond Spray and I'm spraying it in between my baby hairs. I'm gonna go ahead and tie this band around the lace while the spray is drying and then we're just gonna continue with the styling process. I wanted to do a cute little half up, half down style with this hair and I wanted it to be curled as y'all can see from the beginning. So now I'm just going in with the pointy end of one of my edge brushes and I'm using it to part off the section that I would like to be in a ponytail. Once I have this section parted off, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the band from around my head and then I'm just gonna start working on my baby hairs.
Now that the baby hairs are finished, I'm taking my foundation and just pressing it into the lace. Now I'm just going to continue with my half up half down style and I wanted a bang piece at the front of my head so I'm just parting the hair off into a side part kind of like a swoop and I didn't make the part perfect at all y'all. I didn't really care if it was perfect or not so once I have the hair parted off I'm going in with my curling wand and I'm using it to lay the hair down. Now I'm just going back to the ponytail section and I'm going to try to lay it down as flat as possible. So the initial hair tie that I'm putting in is only going to act as my base. As y'all can see, I'm already going back in with my curling wand. And then after that, I'm going to be going on top of it with some of my even lace bond spray and just smoothing everything down with a boar bristle brush. Once I feel like I have everything smooth, I'm going to go ahead and apply another elastic as close to the base as possible. And now we're just going to continue. As you can see, we already pretty much have the base of our style complete. We just have to curl it. So I'm going in with my flat iron and I'm going to use it to curl the hair. I already curled one side as y'all can see and now I'm just going to finish up on this side. I stood up so y'all could see me curl the ends of the hair because I didn't want to curl it fully, just the ends, okay? I only wanted the ends to be curled and as I told y'all, it's a 26 inch so this is pretty much where the hair falls on me and for anybody that's wondering, I'm 4'11". Okay, queen, so after I finished curling my hair, I went to sleep. I'm not even going to hold you. So this footage was filmed the next day, and I had somewhere to be. So I decided to do my makeup to end off this look. And as you can see, my hair is still slayed. I slept in this wig and everything, y'all. And the curls hold up so good. I'm going to stand up so y'all can see the ends of my hair. 10 out of 10 y'all 10 out of 10 I don't have any complaints regarding this hair and if you would like to purchase this unit all of the specs and information that you need will be in the description box down below bye bye queens